Abbot Fuller Graves is now known primarily for his floral still lifes and garden scenes. However, genre and fishing scenes were also subjects. Although his earlier floral paintings were painted in the traditional academic style, his two good friends, Impressionist artists Edmund Tarbell and Child Hassam, likely had some influence on his later style, as these were executed in a higher key and utilized impasto, signatures of the Impressionists. Graves traveled from his home in Boston, Massachusetts, and later Kennebunkport, Maine, to Europe numerous times between 1884 and 1905. On one of his travels prior to 1900, Graves spent time in the fishing village of St. Ives in Cornwall, England, where he completed this painting, Fishing Boat in St. Ives Harbor, Cornwall, England. Take a careful look at the boat in the picture. It appears to be a type of fishing boat unique to St. Ives. Referred to as a jumbo, it was allegedly named after Jumbo the Elephant, who was an attraction at the London Zoo from 1865 to 1882. Two-masted and pointed at both ends with a flat bottom, jumbos were used to catch Cornish pilchard, a delicacy of the Mediterranean countries. Far from an idyllic garden scene, Graves has captured a day in the life of St. Ives fishermen using a lower key palette and traditional painting methods with just a bit of impasto to provide rough texture to the waves of a stormy sea. The jumbos are all gone now, but are here preserved on canvas in the detailed, finely executed brushstrokes of Abbott Fuller Graves. <laughs>